What's up, guys? We have caught this uh, little grass snake or rough green snake. And it's, uh, if you Google grass snake, you won't see this guy. You'll see a different guy, but people commonly call this a grass snake because it's green. We're about to tell you all about this guy. So click like, subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll be right back with the rest of this video. All right, guys, so what we got here is a rough green snake. They're very docile. As a matter of fact, if you if they you encounter one, they're likely to freeze as a defense mechanism opening that you just don't see them in their camouflage. These guys eat a variety of insects, pretty much anything small enough to fit in their mouth and moves. They, uh, in our region, they are the most arboreal I think I I probably butchered the pronunciation of that but basically what it refers to is that they spend their time in trees or above ground and they they hunt up in the canopies and around the vegetation looking for insects and if you find one you will likely find them in a tree somewhere these guys are a lot of fun to play with they domesticate fairly easily as long as you can keep them with a uh, enough food and water. They range pretty much all over the eastern United States from New Jersey down to Texas uh, and throughout Florida as well. They are a lot of fun to play with. If you catch them, don't be scared at all. They're absolutely non-venomous. You can look at his head and his eyes and see how round his eyes are. And also at the shape of his head. He's got no place to store his poison. He has no place to store any poison, that's right. It's a uh, coral snake is kind of a, an exception to that rule. But we're talking about a completely different toxin. They're not pit vipers. So guys, this spring, if you go out looking around in the canopy and pay close attention, you might find one of these guys to play with too. If you see one of these pretty guys, Gabby, come on girl. If you see one of these pretty guys in your garden, don't be alarmed and don't get rid of them because he is going to be very helpful in eating insects that you don't want in there. Very beneficial snake to have around. Pretty much all snakes are beneficial. The, with, I mean, even the venomous ones are beneficial and should probably be left to their own devices unless they're in a place that uh, that they cause a serious danger, like around your livestock or children or something. Yeah, the snakes are pretty awesome. I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope you got some information that you can use. Hey, you want to say bye? Bye, guys. All right. Bye. Thanks for watching. Please click like, subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll see you next time with another video. Bye.